Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Trove. As you can see, I am the gunslinger today because I have not used a gunslinger um, slinger in an awfully long time. So it's time to put my big boy pants on and say, you know what, screw it and actually use a gunslinger. And the thing that I'm actually surprised about is that I'm 20k PR. I didn't expect to get to 20,000 because I basically just threw on... Um, the best gems that I had, the best magical gems, obviously, and I didn't even know that I had some nice gems. The only thing that I um, just got is this one because I didn't actually have a class gem for the gunslinger before I started the video, and this thing took me about um, 10 keys to get. Now, I, I know what you might be saying, this thing has maximum health, so it's like... Why, Joe? Why do you have this? And the reason why is this one actually is perfect. Like, it has two rolls in the crit hit, one in the damage. I, I think it's reversed. I think it's, like, two rolls in the damage and then one in the crit damage or whatever. It's one of those things. But what I'm planning to do is I'm planning to swap the crit hit to uh, um, <clears throat> the crit hit over to crit damage and then the max health to crit hit. So that way it'll be a perfect gem. The only reason why I'm doing it for this one is because this is a class gem and I really do not want to spend keys to get you know I don't want to spend any more class gem keys to actually do this I don't even have that many well I do but where are they yeah 17 I used to have 27 so yeah my RNG is not the best and this my stats you know obviously they're not the best I know I keep saying that oh they're not the best they're not the best but it's it's actually a lot better than I thought. The damage, I'm not sure. The crit hit, it's actually well over 100%. I thought I was going to have like 80 or something like that. I forgot how much crit hit and all that I have. The crit damage is pretty low, but like I said, this isn't exactly my main. So I haven't been fully getting gems with my... Not getting gems, but I haven't... Well, actually, yeah, <laughs> getting gems. I haven't been that focused on getting a magical set these gems are pretty much just um you know passively gotten gems i didn't like farm these or anything these are just the ones that i've so happened to have the pleasure of getting <laughs> but anyway uh enough of the um <laughs> i can't even talk enough about that i'm actually going to be giving away five streamer dream codes yeah who sights on nice <laughs> Yeah, good time to record this, right? So anyway, if you want to uh, have a chance to win the streamer dream codes, and just comment down in the comment section down below. It can be anything; it doesn't really matter. But there are no qualifications to enter. Um, these are streamer dream codes, so you can be on any platform. Like you can be on um, PS4, Xbox One, or PC. It doesn't matter, and you will have a chance to win the code. Uh, a code, and not the code, as in like there's only one, but. Five of you will be able to get more streamer dream boxes. Yes, that that'll be nice. Streamer dream boxes are like one of those things where it's like, it's like you start collecting them at a point. You end up having the like all the streamer allies, and it's like how many boxes can I hoard in? It, it's like one of those things. But the the good thing is um, there they are adding more streamer allies. A, a lot of them actually. I don't know when they're gonna do it. I do know that the devs made about like 30 of them, so that's going to be nice when they end up adding those. But I, I don't know about the Gunslinger. I like him, but it's like he's too overused. That's one of the big things. It's like I don't not like I <laughs> I don't not like him because of the fact that he's overused. It's just that he's I don't know what about it, it's just, he's, he seems too cheap, if that makes any sense, like, as you can see, I don't think my gems are that good, to be honest, but I'm just obliterating all of this, like, it's nothing, and it's just, like, one-shotting it, I don't know if that's just me, I probably secretly do have decent gems, I know, you know, by no means do I have good gems, that's further... Um, further proved by the fact that they're not even maxed out and all that, and some of them aren't even perfect, but the thing is, I do want, you know, magic damage, crit hit, and get over it, <laughs> please, get over the thing, because I, I need to get into the dungeon, but anyway, he does a lot of damage, and it's, it's just one of those things where, I don't know, I guess I'm just not used to it, 
I'm also not used to using the alt to do stuff. I don't know why I, I use the alt. I didn't really need to, but it it'll be it, it'll be fun to use, I guess, every once in a while. The, the the new bubble costume that's coming into this adventure update on Tuesday, which I can't believe the adventure update's already this soon, but that bubble costume, you know, it, 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 that costume alone has made me want to play on the gunslinger, like actually main him. <laughs> I don't know though. I really like that costume. They they went like they went all out on that costume. It's so good. Like how the charge shot is literally just a big bubble and all that. Especially with the adventure update adding the, um, they're, they're changing it. Well, I don't know if you would call it changing or like kind of like fixing. I would kind of refer to it as a fix to be honest, but the making it so the, the class gems VFX are your costume when you actually shoot. So, you know, for instance, when I, when I shoot now, the, the shots are just solid blue. I think the shots are just solid blue, um, solid blue anyway. Yeah, they are, but for other costumes that change the color, the color will actually be changed with the class gem after the update, so that'll be nice. We need some more variety of the classes. All of the all, all of the varieties, yeah. <laughs> very, very, very nice. So, pretty much with these ones, I just keep on spamming my one ability, and I know for a fact I'm not playing the Gunslinger efficiently at all. You know, obviously, I'm used to the Shadow Hunter, and I'll probably always be used to the Shadow Hunter. Not that there's anything to be used to with the Shadow Hunter other than holding left click the entire time, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Let's see, do I have the right stuff on? No, I don't. Okay, so, um, I know the good one is the Lunar Lancer one. But I mainly have the Draculite one because it reduces cooldown by 7. I, even though I don't benefit from the actual subclass, I have it for the cooldown. Um, I'm going to try going back to the Lunar, like the, Lan the, the, the Lunar Lancer thing. I can't even talk today. I don't know why. Is that? Yeah, okay, it is done. And, uh, done. Uh, <laughs> I'm thinking of other stuff right now like I'm thinking of what I'm gonna be doing after the video because I have to do something after this video so it's like I gotta put it out I gotta you know I gotta do all this but let me see let me let me use a flask and then kill him kill him die yeah see like you know I you don't need to use a flask with the gun thing which is like the cool thing obviously you do anyway because of the you know because it's a lot faster and maybe let me let me see something. Conjurer, let's get this vial on <laughs> because we need it. Well, not need it, but I, I've heard that the you know the Conjurer's Crucible vial is one of the best vials in the game for adventuring. Just because when you, well, if you have high magic find that is. But anyway, let's just do this and yeah, see we got a flask back. So if you have a high enough magic find, then I guess this is a you know it's a good flask. It's it's really nice. <clears throat> so about this butterfly, how do you how do you guys like this um, event? This event's actually cool. I like the event. You know, other than doing the twenty three stars and all that, I really don't care about it. But you know, this event, the mount that this event has is like really nice. That's like a really weird graphical glitch right there. Look at that, it's weird. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not used to um, having the occasion, like the occasional right click and all that. It's weird. Like, all this is so weird to me. I don't know why. I do know that when you shoot stuff in the air... It, oh, <laughs> I was trying to press Q. I knew that was going to happen. Oh, you know what we should do, guys? No. <laughs> Get world ID. And let's do the same trick that we did last time. This is going to be so nice. Get to do this trick two times, once, like, you know what I mean. <laughs> I don't need to explain myself. And then, go to world, and then actually paste it in, like, jeez, don't, <laughs> don't instinctively do the wrong thing now. Yeah, see, isn't that so nice that we can just do that, and look how big this butterfly is. Yeah, the, the gliding animation of the butterfly seems really weird to me, I don't know why. Like, it makes sense. But just the way the butterfly looks, it, like the gliding animation is so weird. I don't know why. It, it like I kind of just explained why, but you know what I mean. It, it's it's just weird. So let's see how this works out. These guys I can pretty much just kill in one shot, but at the same time, it's like 
I don't want to overshoot because I know the charge shot breaks blocks like mad. Like, like look at this. I already like accidentally broke all these blocks, and it's 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 um, one of those things where it's mainly the glass because obviously, as you know, glass breaks like in two hits with this thing. So, don't want to do that. Is this um okay? Yeah, that's that, that's one of the main other um, things I don't like about the uh, gunslinger is just that. That, I know that doesn't make him a bad class or anything, it's just, uh, I don't know, like, doesn't, does this charge shot really need to do that much block damage, like, is that necessary, like, like, really, and like I said, that's mainly only against the glass, that's not as big of a deal like anything else, like, as you can see, it's not even affecting these blocks, but then again, I can't break this, <laughs> which every single dungeon in the game should be like that, but unfortunately, it's not. I don't know why. Let's just do like one more dungeon or so and then actually um stop the video cuz I'm already at like 11 minutes. I didn't I didn't know that I was so far. Uh, I got so far. <laughs> this is one of my favorite dungeons with this guy. I don't know why. So like you just stand here and then you just shoot down. I don't know why it's so satisfying with this dungeon. Maybe it's because they all spawn like next to you or something. It's weird though. Yeah, but no matter how, um, like, no matter, like, how fast I try to do this, I always only get to, like, 25 before the charge shot wears off. I don't know if that's just lag or if that's just something. It's weird. But anyway, I'm going to stop the video there, guys. So, in the next video, maybe I'll continue playing on the Gunslinger because the Gunslinger is actually fun. I like the Gunslinger. I like me some guns. Some running gun action. <coughs> So until then, guys, see you later. So have a nice day. And pfft, goodbye. I should ins um, insert the exploding house again, but I won't because that that's it's too much editing for me. <laughs> Not really. So anyway, guys, for real this time. See you later and goodbye.